Who needs melee when I've got a big gun? All right, so we're doing Age of Death. Um, I think. Wait, how do I set? How do I set the difficulty? Is this a four? Oh yeah, if you go to the machine, cancel that. Reject it. Yeah. I think it's. Ah, shit. Okay, so if you interact with that, and yeah. then tap left, you'll see the difficulties. If you are for change, or click it. Alright. There you go. Why is it called Roofless, but in the game it's called Angel of Death? Like... Uh, whatever. The and then, um, in future, if you ever meet, if you've got a limited number of people and you're setting up before everyone's joined, in the top right, you can change it if it's private or not. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, because if you just set the mission and you'll have it to swap some just search. Alright, brothers. you got to carry me, as always. So, Turk, you're not going to suicide this time, right? I didn't suicide, I just dropped the gene seed. You you took the gene seed and immediately died. Yes, now oh, you're shit. making me look bad on camera because you're not skilled enough. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Now's your chance to prove, you know, rise from the ashes. Don't worry, I won't help you. Brother. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, I'm also running uh, level 1 weapons. I like how we're all very distinctly coloured. Well, I mean, we look normal. You look very distinct. <laughs> Aren't we like practically the primary colours? Red, blue and green. I mean red, blue and yellow, sorry. Used to store Prometheum in the refinery to destroy the enemy swarm. The Cadians were tasked with providing assistance. But I we have since lost contact. Yeah, I was like about to skip then I realised Probably better to, you know, be able to proceed to the Cadian outpost and establish their fate. Got to think of the, uh, was that the music that we're watching? The refinery and complete demolitions to point. Talking of which, only when I the take it everyone else is muted. No, I hear you, that he, everyone hears you, so... Okay, yeah, that's that was my assumption. So, no crazy talk. You can do that in between missions. Smackdown. I watched the first episode of my Let's Play for this and oh my god, like I'm so much better at the game now. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm giving you a try, Heavy. Oh, what does my Q ability do on this? Uh, yeah. It gives a shield so if people shoot it, it will just hit the shield. It's a ah. full ranged shield. Yeah, it's like nice. 180 degree protection or something from shooting. Okay. So obviously people can also like hide behind you when you've got a shield out. Oh, I guess um, Turk and Tim, he'll need help with uh, knowing where the relics spawn and that kind of stuff. Yeah. Places. Well, I know you know all the places, but he doesn't know the places, so I'm saying if you, if you point them out to him, like, that's one of the locations in Canterbury, Dan. So, uh, do you have to take this map at all? I, I don't think he's played any operations. Okay. Yeah, this is my first operations. We done the missions. Well, we did the campaign, sorry, and now we're... Uh... We're moving on to other things. Okay. We're angel of death in all the way because we're... Yeah, let's go to the da data slate. Oh yeah, that's true. There's some data slates in the mission stuff. So just collect them. Yeah, just yeah, I was, I was told about that as well. Yeah. Oh, I've already got that one apparently. Oh. Did uh, nice. Brother Kaiser tell you about the data slates by chance? Um, he it? told me... Yeah, yeah. Brother Kaiser was very keen to spoilerize things. He's like, oh, in a, I think this is the bit where this happens. And I was just like, dude, this is supposed to be a blind run. <laughs> and it's just, yeah, but, yeah, oh, but he, he, he was very, very excited. He was, uh, he was very happy to be playing Spade Room. That's good to hear. There's, uh, have you watched any of the Let's Play yet? Because there's, there's quite a lot of shade that goes off. <laughs> the conversation. Oh, only a brief amount of one. Yeah, I imagine it was pretty serious to start with, and then about three episodes on, it's just us giving each other shit all the time. <laughs> no, I dodged the wrong way. Hmm. 
thought he was stuck in a tree for a second. Yoink! I just squished him. But yeah, basically, I think it's pretty much anywhere a guardian relic spawns, it could be a GC. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Okay. And you can also deactivate this build prematurely if you want as well. Oh, okay. Since I pressed it by accident, that's good to know. Yep. There's a noon down there. Yeah, so this is the same with the special for the sniper and so forth. Oh god, whatever jump down into. Well, hi guys! So, I don't know if this would have been something we learned in the single player, but with that um, barb stuff, you can shoot the central bit and then destroy it. Oh my god! I might need some help here. There's there's a couple of warriors over here. I'm struggling. Oh no! Uh, it's so Turk it's down. down. Okay, I'm coming yeah. Turk. I'm in the hallway. The one that is shooting back. Yes, I'm first. Uh, oh no! They won't let me get you up. Brother Tim, yeah, brother, okay, it's I all on I'm you. <laughs> oh god! There's three more. There's seven warriors. No problem! <laughs> I was about to say, I only idea. have five shots on the stalker rifle. No issue. So obviously, <laughs> this wasn't a proper game. This was just like a, a warm-up. That, that was the warm-up yeah, room, clearly. Well, when I jumped down there, I didn't expect there to be five warriors, you know? Yeah. I'll be honest, I thought it was you who went down and not Turk, so I was like, ah, we still got this, chill. But yeah, you, life or death is decided by the parry. Well, yeah, but the thing yeah, is, I was trying to parry, but then there were two more warriors stood behind yes, the one I was parrying. Parry because there is too many of them. And then yeah, when I was like, oh, I'm down, it, then I, I saw, you know, three more coming. I was like, wow, I got 20 EXP, amazing balls. Yep. Well, I mean, XP farming was fast, wasn't it? <laughs> it was fast. No, I don't think it was fast, to be honest with you. <laughs> Wait, how long was that? It was eight minutes. Eight minutes for 20 experience. All right, so we've done this test run. All right. This this time, boys. Mission select is not available. No, you, you still got it. Because you didn't, like, succeed in it, it's still your current mission. Yeah. Will it yeah, all be set to Angel of Death and everything, then? Yeah, yeah it's, it's still, you can see like threat level ruthless. And the vanguard right or there. assault? Yeah, a vanguard or assault. Where do I see the threat level though? I think. Uh, just I above the picture it says threat ruthless, just below Inferno. Oh, okay, on the right hand side, yeah. yeah. Primary just go with whatever you're comfortable playing with, dude. I'm playing with Blueberry class. Okay, this is better for protecting. Better for protecting? I wasn't the first one to go down. <laughs> Just, nice. just, just pointing that out. Like, I'm not throwing shade. I'm just saying. I, I think what Turk is saying is he was your meat shield that mission. Yeah. I mean, he, he, he has to do this on his own. Okay, we can we can skip the cutscenes this time around. We've we've done it once. This time, lads. This time. See what it is, is that I was so yellow I scared them, so that they left me till second. Yeah, and I camouflaged in the jungle. In my the, bl life. the blue jungle, yeah? <laughs> I have a turn, it's colorblind. 
Considering what you were saying about the colorblind option, I'm planning to stream that one of the streams just to show off how it is. <laughs> oh, do you want me to actually demonstrate it? Because I mean, it might be interesting to see. <laughs> it was. It was. Yeah. Okay. If I ever do the campaign again, I will do it in full colorblind mode. Oh no, I was thinking like not the campaign, but just like for one operation if you just do it. Uh, and after death is a smurf, though. You're asking me to be a smurf marine. Why would you have to be a smurf? Like because the like Smurfs like look pink, so you know. Oh. You look like Ephraim's children, probably. Symptoms indicate the presence of toxins. Well, someone over there shooting me. I can't see him very well. Oh, yeah, there's that guy there too. Oh, I'm down. Wow. That was really annoying not being able to see. Not gonna lie. Yeah, being poisoned is normally a downer for most people. Is it actually poison though? Because, like, you're in full ammo. Yeah, is it, is it a oh bit odd? Oh my god, that, oh yeah, the as well. Wow, are we all just gonna Turk? Turks, now is your time to shine, save his brother. Oh, if you can use Q and E to cycle through people whilst you dance, so you can watch Turks or his combat. Can I? We can, we can yeah. watch his, his comeback. Yeah. One man. Hello. Can I pick him up? No, I'm actually just gonna stay. <laughs> Commendation request initiated. Conversion field operational. Okay, can you actually, like, stop? Uh, there we go. Damn it. He didn't want to come out of that mode, though. Also, it's incredibly confusing swapping between Dark Tide and Space Marine. Oh, you might notice the glowy flowers uh, here and there, Dan. Yeah, they explode. So, if you shoot it, um, it will explode and do damage to stuff near it. Does it do friendly fire? Um, I'm not sure. I think uh, the explosives, the the aerial ones, the ones we throw, they might stagger you, but. Oh yeah, I mean, if, if a grenade gets thrown, it will stagger you, but it won't actually hurt you. The, the stack oh, is good next to you, for that. Kill confirmed. Major tyranny threat. Converge on objective. Look available. Alright, let's try not to separate this time. <laughs> I'll be honest, I'm just waiting for the other foot to drop. Like, uh, for a counterfact or something to drop it. That's true, at level 4 they can do that. Yeah, it's just 
Alright, so twice you bet, sport extremists will be half the day. Wow, you guys are first. obsessed. Oh wait, you said extremists. Jesus Christ. Yeah. High damage. Um, the shooting really does do a lot of damage. Tim, the ravages behind you. Oh my god, the top of that. Yeah, we will fuck you off the bridge. <laughs> Ducka 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 ducka. Alright, uh, what's on us at next extreme is what we get later. Is there a particular one you think's worse? Um I think Link that bounces around all the time. Yeah, in the campaign he was he was real annoying. Okay, that, that was annoying because, like, it looked like he was going to hit you, but he was actually trying to hit me. Oh, I'm dead. Brother! <laughs> no! Oh, I guess one thing can pull this out. Don't worry, you'll respawn when we open. Yeah, yeah, 100 seconds of impact. You can see, um... Yeah, when they get down to a certain point, you automatically spawn them. Um, but uh, you can see Tim's got a more wound than you did when you died, which is why you're dead. Um, if you um, are, if you manage to get full health back, and with, whilst you have a mortal wound and use a health kit, you'll uh, remove your mortal wound. Yeah, is there a way for the heavy to get more healing? Because like you know, yes. it's the executions um, generally which give you a mortal wound, wound back, wound right? With you. Okay, we're holding here. Probably there's a bulwark with you, okay. Sure, Are we looking yeah. on ammo? Get have two mags. I'm, I'm full, uh, miraculously. All you okay, gotta do is die and you get free ammo. Or the wave isn't coming. Well, I, I guess you gotta actually press the button first, yeah? There we go. We are here. Now what, Captain? You need to acquire the Astra Militarum yeah, they're up there. Source one from any soldier you see, alive or otherwise. Outside of all. Yeah, oh, all the oh. side. Yes, behind you, Dad. Oh, they are from the back, from the front, and from both left, right, and left. Neither. We can shoot in all directions, brother. Behind you. Yeah. Everywhere. Well, isn't there an infinite ammo crate right there? Yes. There is. It's just getting the timing to get it what's not being attacked, I guess. Yeah, this is a bit rough for level ones. But yeah, if the him. Walk, um, puts the flag down, what's this, and it's execution ready. You can basically execute, get all your health back, and then, like, as I use a med pack just to get rid of more wound. Do, do we even have a bulwark here? You do not. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think so. It, it's a hypothetical benefit. If, if you had one. Who is trying to shoot me? See any healing? A waste of time. Look, brother, I'm doing the blood raven. Checking the pockets. Any relics? Got them. That's it. 
Oh, you are ready to get the demolition started. Proceed to the oh, yeah, so you'll see Turk has a little red dot the next to him, which means that he's carrying a relic. You can also see the first time. About to. All these tents and no healing, are you kidding me? Yeah, there is almost no drops on this difficulty. Okay, noted. Yeah, ammo can be potential issues. Iron Halo, one line. The minimum drops and stuff. Anyway, master the dodge roll. I would say it's not a, it's not a good class to be under level good. Yeah. Heavy. Unblocked. I think the scout would be easier because you can just run off. This is where we sow the enemy. Dacker. Down! Cool. Yeah. Cool. 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 An enemy wave! Fun! And, like, five orders! Yeah, because there's no way! Yeah, the will switch whoever has a shield. Let's take the damage. I'm not sure you can damage it once it's got shield. And I can't roll while I'm in focus mode either. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. Yep. Him seems to have taken a touch of damage as well. I'm so hard <laughs> Am I the only yeah, one who backed up to the place where there aren't aliens? Yes. That is okay. Great, that. Good to know, I'm completely on my own. <laughs> oh god, there's more of them, isn't there? Cool. Yeah, I got the zone through, I was going after me, man. <laughs> and uh, maybe a turn in warrior as well. Could I maybe get an assist? <laughs> no. Yeah, there's a turning warrior and two zone throws, man. Come on. You're, you're being bad cannon fodder. You're being good cannon fodder. Well, when we fail the mission because I'm dead, you will oh, not be good ready. cannon fodder. <laughs> oh, I can't actually go it's back any end. further. Alright, nice, nice, okay. Alright, so the shield doesn't do anything against that. Okay, got it. Not against psychic damage, no. Now you tell me, Alpha. <laughs> We're stuck in a gun. <laughs> it's just like real life, Dan. Think of it that way. I didn't think I had to ask for something like that. I didn't think you'd activate a shield against psychic like, attacks, to be honest. Well, I was basically trying to focus down the warrior, but, you know. It was hopeful that it would at least reduce the damage. Obviously, this you've got is you don't have your perks or weapon upgrades and stuff. So yeah, I'm level one in it. It's rough. Obviously, you know, yeah. Turk's chose to bring his level 25. You know, clearly, skill issues. Oh! Inked him down. Okay, I'll just start rolling, I guess. Yeah, have you seen this? <laughs> have you seen this? That's exactly what murdered me. <laughs> I didn't even have that chance to throw away. Yeah, um, the Space Marines are big fans of Limp Biscuit. Keep rolling. That dark sucks. Don't worry, you've only got to hold out for 30 seconds and I'll save you. Nice, no without shields anymore. Oh, it gets worse down. There's a neuro throat, which is a boss version of this. But there's oh, yeah. only one of them. Yeah, yeah fuck yeah. it. It's at least only one. Yeah, but if you're a melee combat kind of person, you kind of got problems okay. against it. Considering all this, I'm quite fine. 
Oh, another Guardian Relic for me, nice. We said that I could have that. Okay. I think Tim should probably get it. Uh, Unless yeah, you don't want it. Uh, it's right in front of me, floating ominously. Acknowledged. In thin uh, air. The power of the Emperor. Yeah. yeah. I wish I had two chain swords at this point. Injecting stims. Now we're just missing our Lictor and the Conifax, basically. One down. So now he's in the wall. No spores. Someone shoot it. Different loadouts, your classes. Medicare. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, if you just use the same thing, you get all your ammo back. Or you can change weapon if you want. I think I'll I'll swap to the plasma. Yeah. That's my least favourite heavy gun. You're welcome. <laughs> That will Use the cords to prime the bomb and finish it. Oh, let, let's not do sound clips because YouTube and copyright strikes. Uh, okay. Good point. Oh, well, yeah. So, um, just behind you, Dan, you'll see the little floating skull. That's one of the locations, the armor data. The Turks already got it, but on your. Yep, there. You see the glowing light, the skull? Hmm. Yeah, so. A fair bit of the time it does spawn there. So Turk's just hogging all the resources is what you're saying? Oh no no, it's shared across the entire team for the armoury data. Okay. You just need one person to get it. And you also get an armoury data point if you defeat something like a boss, like a Carnaflex or a newer frog and so forth. I actually managed to hear my mortal wound. Nice. I didn't think I'd make it. You want them? Dan has activated the event. Rights of activation have been observed. The the machine god's name. You all seem to die down here. Delivering payload. Because we're not down anywhere. We're up here. Delivering payload. We have the eye ground, Anakin. Uh, you might want, not want to stand over there. X Max is aligned. I got you baited. Burn the point. Okay, I'm going. Right. Got a defense generator too. Going it. Oh. I'm using the broom. Oh my god, this. This is not good for melee, is it? Okay. Defended? No, this is like the worst. Oh, I weave. Go away. Well, the good news is the generator's defended. Uh, sniper. Cool. Uh, that's never sniper. Down. Ah. Yeah, if you see one of those, like, kind of line things lining up on you, just roll. Yeah, it's quite nice. Oh, here comes the... Whatever it is. 
Oh, oh, okay. And it's probably gonna kill me, yeah? Mm, maybe. Oh, no, I love late down and I've got my own. Jeesh. Yeah, yeah, you're not gonna get me back up with a Ravenna there. Just parry. So why don't you like the plasma? Uh, just the arcing fire. I, not fan of that. I like to shoot things in the line. It shoots in the line rather than have to be. Oh, I need to aim a bit up and all that sort of. I mean, it's nice in the fact that like it gets through like the guards when the um, Tyranid warriors do the whole sword thing. It's just like, yep, that doesn't really matter. Now, Tim, you will get the jeans this time. <laughs> like, this is literally take is it. here. Take it. Okay, I'll take uh, this. Don't two. Found something useful. That's extra XP, but if you if the person carrying it gets down, you're not allowed to die now. Exactly. Yeah. Them's the rules we've just made up. Tim is now the most important person in the team. Something wrong with this gun, it won't kill Turk. Well, oh, up. also a Turk. Oh no, I'm not so that because we're recording this. I'll, I'll t remind me later, I've got something to tell you. Maybe. Well, what you don't know is the Primus Renid Marines are now using Tau technology, so uh, they've got like smart bullets that don't harm friends. Can you imagine that? Oh, I, I Although it isn't that isn't that a, a meme though? They're like, well, it won't. They won't hurt the faithful. Yeah, because they have Aquila on them. Yeah. Dirk has seen the meme. Yeah, like, um... There was a book where, like, the tower first meet the orcs, and like, maybe we can barter with them, and they give them a load of guns, and the orcs get excited, and they throw the guns to shoot the tower, and then the guns don't let them. <laughs> I, I am sure that that is stolen directly from um, Fifth Element, where I use the seeking rounds. To say it. No, we wait until the Xenos swarm reaches our position. But just think of the extra armory data. Just remember, you're not allowed to die, Tim. is a weapon. Overconfidence is a disadvantage. Tim needs all the med kits now. Yeah, I'm aware of the situation. Oh, that's a lot of warriors. A lot of sport. Executed. Fatality. Dan hop the ammo box. No, Dan didn't. You calibrate your aim, brother. Four mines, four mines, four mines, four mines, four mines. Oh, this is going to be extremely effective. 
Oh, this one line. Oh. Yeah, that's the thing with some more down to like a short range shotgun. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Quickly, cool, man. Ah, I know that's part of my life. Oh, no, that's part of my life. Go away. I'm stuck behind a thing. So there's a thing to do with I sometimes just put out my pistol and uh, yeah. shoot a few bullets off on that. Oh, that's a good idea. Because, multi especially yeah. on this stage, yeah. they just really so fucking many. Yeah, and that was shred for your health as well. Yeah, Boys it was, in the like at the end when we were getting pushed back, that was what was happening. There just spores everywhere. I died, but I got better. <laughs> <laughs> um, what I tend to do with the Motive Outer is like shoot and then roll and shoot. Ready for next encounter. Active into repeat. Motor skills degenerating. Mm -hmm. the gear. Right. Okay, so this is the ending section. Now we get to fight. Okay, Come so on, basically, can I fix? Um, there's three bits. There's a middle on each side, and what you want is one person on each bit, and then when you figure out which direction the wave's coming from, uh, the person on one of the sides will activate their thing, and then, and then the person in the middle will activate theirs once there's enough enemies. Okay. Um, the only thing is when, when somebody activates one of the sides, you can't activate the other one. So. Uh, yeah, do left. Now they are attacking okay. actually from both sides. They're attacking from the other side. We may be overrun, I have the Prometheum ready. They cover you. Initiating burn. The bulk of the swarm is continuing along the protected path. Continue. Yeah, some did come up this way. You son of a bitch. This thing. You're Unlimited uh, ammo for most amount of this belt massive. I imagine it does. Well, that was the wrong way to roll then. <laughs> oh, we also come from the center. Whip dies at quite a point. Mm hmm. He's fighting uh, for you. One of the sides. Fighting where? Ah, there. One of the sides, yeah. I'm down. Oh no, I'm dead. No, we oh, really? I mean, Tim's still up. We must, we must deploy the virus ball. Tim's the only one who matters. <laughs> assuming that Tim doesn't go down in the mission as one, that's uh, about 2.5k of XP, which will get quite multiple levels now. Mm. I really don't feel like they're heavy in my kind of build, though, you know? That's fair enough, I mean. Okay, it is a lot of house to play. Oh, I'm going to activate the left. So go down the center. But, oh well, you only know that once you've done it, don't you? So. Exactly. You want to get up here, you bastard? Fuck, activate the... Get that I'm doing it, I'm doing it! I have to crash them! Fuck it! We're near to be good about now. The swarm has almost fully committed. Be ready for my mark. Yeah, 
traps here. It's too quiet. You are clear ah, to okay. detonate. Kick those rock bastards. Save the city. Yes, Captain. You heard him. Boom, boom, boom. Valius to Titus. Greetings from the prime. Turning in biosites down 90% and fall. Swarm annihilation confirmed. Excellent work. Move to extract. Three, two, one. We have got to go. Thunderhawk arriving at evac point. Ramp down and ready. What's the match point if you, you know, using the drop pod to get down, Dan? So you just go back up now. Extraction complete. Returning to orbit. Commendable one brothers, you honor your chapter. Be ready for rearm, refit, and redeployment immediately. So that was probably the easiest mission. I would say. Yeah. So what kind of play style do you think would be your kind of thing, Dan? Well, I don't know. I mean, it's a problem. It's, it's a it sounds like you want something with a bit of melee. Well, melee is just something you always have to do because they put nids in the game, right? So, like, yeah. not being able to do melee, like, can the sniper actually melee or is he also going to be an idiot and try and does hit? have a knife. He has a knife, wow. And it has a knife, so you can run away. Yeah. And he has what? He has stealth, has ability. Yeah, you can just cloak like a predator. Which is pretty useful for getting rid of aggro. Yep. Well, all the way to level oh, five already. Is. Yeah. What are you trying to say? Yeah. <laughs> and be obviously because you're playing level four, you're getting the most um, requisition points as well. Uh, okay. So, can we bring any class we want to this? Could we have the same classes, or is no, that no? no. You can only have one of each class. So, what class are you guys? I'm tactical, and that's basically a uh, mix of everything. How do you change your class? Which button yeah, is if, it? If you do what you just did, the um, the tab, and then you go to the uh, armory. Tab and armory. Armory hill, yeah. So if you interact with that, you can choose your class as well as modify your weapons. Uh, ah, okay. Stuff. So you've got what? Tactical and Vanguard? I can switch. No, no, it's fine if you're happy with those. I um, mean, Turk might want to go heavy. Because he does enjoy heavy. Does he? He does. He's pretty good at it, to be fair. To be honest, I kind of like the idea of assault. But maybe I shouldn't start with assault. I'll do a sniper. We'll try a sniper out. Like. Yep. Or, um, uh, oh, yeah. Um, now we have our because, this, because this weapon is used over multiple classes... Um, you can, you know, the level up will be for everyone, so to speak, that uses the pull pistol. Oh, okay. Right. And if you go to the versions, uh, you can unlock uh, a better version of it, which do more damage. And what you can see, what it's showing you, the differences. And of course, pretty much everything costs requisition. Yeah. Uh, so now you've done that, you've got uh, the choice of what main weapon you'd like to go for. Uh, okay, back to the thing. Okay, what are his options? So we can go for a standard issue crap gun. Yeah. Actual. So you t two variants of sniper, and then like a mini gun, like a submachine gun, like well, a multi, you know, like a 
Yeah, submachine gun, I guess, is the most accurate thing. That's what that is. Um, I wouldn't recommend it myself, but, you know. So I'd recommend one of the main sniper guns. Um, that one is basically standard, like, sniper. And that last fusel, um, you have to charge up the shots. No, 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 we're not doing that. <laughs> yeah, Bolt is pretty reliable. Yeah. And that's what I just unlocked as well, isn't it? And that's I have a choice knife. of knife, knife, or knife. Well, a knife's better than nothing. Yep. Alright. Oh, hang on. Hang on. I need to put an helmet on, because why on earth am I showing my face? Well, um, to get a helmet, that's a special situation for the sniper. Oh, are you kidding you me? You would have to spend requisition points. No, granted, you have over 400 of them. I have to customize it and just add an helmet, basically. Yeah. Doesn't he at least have um, a face mask? No, I think Dan wants a full helmet. So if you. Um... Oh, yeah, that's hard. Oh, no, it's part of the Space Marine DLC. Oh, all the helmets part of the Space Marine DLC? Yeah. No, just the sniper. Oh, well, screw you then, I guess. I guess we're just doing this with the uh, silly face on display. Well, the Black Templar one is DLC. And the Dev one one. Yes, yeah. And there we go. Are you, are you sure? So, uh, yeah. Um, oh, wait, please never check. If we go to that and they go to uh, Edit Armor, and they go to Heraldry. Yeah, yeah, get. Whatever. I, th I think it's just showing the message because I'm pretty sure other things aren't. Yeah, there we go. Right. So if you, yeah, if you look over the Black Templar one in the middle, uh, what's the final thing? Like if you hover over the armor bit. Yeah. Yeah. So you granted you have to unlock everything before it, but you've got enough for it. There you go. Now you should be able to equip that helmet. Okay, so if you go back, because this is basically just choosing the colour scheme and like uh, stuff like that. So if you go, do I have to go all the way back and yeah, yeah, do it? yeah, and then uh... wow, well, guys, this is annoying. Okay, you wanna, if you go to armour sets at the top, and then from that, if you customise armour set. So yeah. And then you should be able to change the uh, helmet to the one you've just unlocked. Uh, it probably been near the bottom. Yeah, there you go. What a lot of faffing just to put an helmet on. Yeah. All right, thank you. But what a helmet. And of course, over time, you'll be able to unlock uh, the different colors. And always wear your helmet. So should we still do level four or level three? Yes. No, level 4. But we tried oh, this time. This decapitation this time. This time. Oh, 